Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Sagittarian Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful support, likes, and shares. Um, you Sagittarians, Ooh, it's hot, it's hot, it's hot, it's hot. Okay, so this is the May reading for the Sagittarians. Now, this is a wonderful month for you Sagittarians, whatever is transpiring and happening. You guys have your own energy vibration in this month. It is the energy of strength, okay? So this is wonderful. So whatever that is transpiring in your life, you have the energy of strength that is going to be carrying you through, and it is your own energy vibration. So expect May to be a powerful month for you Sagittarians. Okay, I've changed up the way of the readings. Let me know how you guys like this. Please cross-watch. This reading is more than an hour long, and it is going to be the... A 50 minutes on YouTube and another 50 minutes is going to be on um, on demand okay so let's see what's coming out if the energy of this month is for energy it's a fire energy the energy of the lovers here in the first week whatever the situation is whatever is happening you are going to be dealing with the energies of the lovers now the energy of the lover comes out as it could be a twin flame relationship it could be a soulmate relationship whatever is transpiring is that you are going to be dealing with someone who could be a family member um, that sort of a situation it could be a husband or wife um, that sort of a situation is going to be happening it can be positive but it can be also negative so it depends so energy of the tower is here whatever the situation is between you and someone um, this is coming to an end um, it could be a breakup that is coming in in the third week definitely a breakup and it has to do this breakup could have to do with an organization or people in power whatever lies and deceitfulness is going to be coming down the fourth week you have the energy of uh, um, the M the um, Empress so let's kind of focus this in the center so you guys can see now, whatever the situation with the energy of the love is something could be coming to an end for some of you in relationship um, uh, some of you could be dealing with people in power that you're taking down a dishonest uh, situation and uh, at the last week uh, you're going to be financial stable in whatever is transpiring so let's see what is the ending that is coming with this relationship definitely um the first week of may some of you your relationship is going to be ended okay so whatever the situation whatever that was transpiring it could be the end of a relationship between you and a child the end of the relationship between you and your soulmate or twin flame or your wife or husband what is coming up in the second week going in the third week you're seeing the truth to a situation with people in power you're seeing exactly what has played that there was some power struggle some power play, um, um, things and it is now coming to an end you're seeing the truth to an organization um, whoever and whatever that organization is you're seeing the truth to an organization but some of you are going to be very financial stable that is coming out the wheel of fortune is here in the second week so whatever is transpiring the second week is going to be taken down um, and removing something that was blocking you it could be a relationship it could be people that was blocking you it could be um, people in power that was doing something that was right um, so it comes up in different form but an ending is coming in now the energy of the moon is coming up that you're having some people some deceptive people in an organization um, it could be um, people in in powers you could be fighting with people in an organization so some of you are going to be standing up for your rights with a situation and fighting um, to, to, to get to get um, you um, uh, um, a situation correctly to be looked at and you're showing them that there is some illegalities that is going on and you're showing up these legalities now at the end of May um, this month is going to be a new start because you're leaving all that has happened for the five of uh, first month and you're moving away from this uh, um, this um, this sort of situation because the wheel of fortune is bringing in um, a situation where you're dealing with some really deceitful um, people 
around you and deceitful people in organization and situation where you are taken down and you're making sure justice is coming up and justice is going to be prevailing over an organization so some lies and deceitfulness and I hope you guys can see this um, some lies and deceitfulness that was going on is now going to be finally coming to an end because definitely some of you were dealing with some um, deceitful situation because as you look and you see what is definitely playing out is that um, this could be also that there was um, divorce and uh, um, some 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 really deceptive situation and you are bringing this down your whatever is transpiring some of you could be fighting for the rights of your child or fighting for the rights of your family or fighting for the rights of something that is happened with some injustice that has happened okay you are going to be having like in the sec the the third week going in the fourth week um, what you're having is that you're having a situation with organization institutes where you're standing up against injustice that has taken place and you will be getting like people trying to come at you but justice is going to come in and prevail the situation you are leaving the month on a positive positive ending because you have decided that I'm cutting out this BS whoever that was messing around and whatever these lies and deceitfulness that was messing around of whoever and whatever that was doing this you're taking them down some of you um, um, are going to be realizing that there has been some really deceptiveness that has paid as, as, as uh, transpired some real deceptiveness that has transpired and you guys are really going to be um, seeing this happening and you are standing up for justice and equality so this is a, a, a month where you Sagittarians realize that there was some real deceptive thing that has taken place and you are standing up for justice and equality if you notice um, the energy of justice can came, came out here and said and it's, it's as if some of you are using your swords of truth to, to um, reveal some deceptive situation in the organization and you're going to be um, receiving a lot of money and you're going to be walking away from this situation when it comes up to the lovers um, the energy of the lovers whenever it comes up to the energy of the lovers definitely some of you could be meeting a twin flame or a soulmate from a past life and you could be starting a new journey with this person okay because definitely this person is coming in in the first week where um, you're going to be starting a new journey here in the second week uh, whatever is transpiring is that you're seeing the truth of the situation and you're going to be taking down your enemies you're going to be taking them down one and one hit taking down all your enemies okay it's as if you decided hell no I'm standing up and I'm standing up for um, this deception is deception that has been going on and I'm I, I am standing up for my rights okay and that is good your wishes and dreams are definitely going to be coming true um, this is wonderful this is good and uh, for some of you um, this could be happening in the first week where your wishes and dreams is coming true it says fulfillment of your wishes and dreams fulfillment of your wishes and dreams comes up in this month so some of you that was wishing and hoping that something would happen like you end a negative situation um, with um, some deception people and deception situation that was happening you are going to be taking that down then we have the energy of uh, hope which is uh, the number 17 energy the energy of star so your wishes and dream is going to be coming true and there is hope there is definitely hope that is going to be coming up especially hope between you and someone um, it's as if the universe is going to definitely make a situation right okay um, between you and a person it could have been someone who has done you some real injustice and karma is coming back for this child this person um, there is definitely um, um, solution uh, solitude um, that you guys are going to be having there is definitely solitude where you are going to be stepping back from everything that is going around you if you notice you have two major powerful major arcana number nine ninety nine is the ending of a cycle 
there is going to be some obstacles but you're going to be um, um, uh, capable of removing these obstacles okay you're definitely going to be capable of removing these obstacles um, ladies and gentlemen um, just protect yourself because what is transpiring here is that whatever that was going on between it could be that you have divorced someone and someone or you didn't want to have a relationship with someone we will look at the relationship reading and this person has done some real injustice to you and now everything is about to come out in this month and you're taking down just everyone that has deceitfully um, affect you in your life you are like I am taking you all down and you're moving away and you're doing this in a very conscious way because um, their justice is coming in the spirit energy for you Sagittarians is the energy um, you are the creator so call upon this um, spiritual this is the spirit spirit animal for you guys and I, I will lay here the spirit animal is for you guys um, in um, this month. You're having the spirit animal in this month and it is the auto spirit. The auto spirit is here. The auto spirit it says you are never alone you are never alone and there's a lot of people who always said oh I feel so alone you're never alone each and every person have at least four guiding angels okay each and every one of us have spirit guides wherever in this universe that we're from we all have spirit guides okay so wherever we are from in this universe we all have spirit guides so whether or not you feel alone the universe and the spirit of the hotter spirit is coming in to say that you're never alone okay and the hotter spirit is uh, um, um, some of you are going to be seeing things very clear in this month very very clear okay the message for you guys is that um, have you been um, challenged all your affection to just one person or um, continue on only one friend or one individual to hold you up um, you know this is a time where you are going to be um, challenging on yourself and your spirit guides to come in okay like true friends auto nurture each other and express their affection through touch affection such as holding hands and giving hugs uh, offered a reassurance that we are never really alone that we have always been cherished how is spirit as a pair to remind you to express the friendship in angelical forms communicate with your voice and um, a facial expression you're you're get you're just gestured so it is um, wonderful and it is positive because your spirit guides are coming in and they're helping you to move forward so always call upon your spirit guides your animal spirit guides all of your spirit guides to come in and help you through whatever situation it is that you're going through in May okay because May you're leaving May taking down all the people and situation and you're going to be um, okay now the Sun this is a beautiful energy um, to receive the energy of the Sun is here and the affirmation is I radiate golden light and decisive decisively take action I radiate golden light and decisively takes action the Sun is the navel chakra of the universe it radiates the divine masculine principle Onto us choosing this card suggests that the universe is calling on you to develop your qualities of decisive action protecting the um, the, val the vanillation and um, rationalization thinking courage and strength I now invoke in all to light up your aura 
and fill your aura with renewal enthusiastic for life this energy will enable you to help each and every person feel welcome and empowered which is an important ascension qualities your guidance is to fill your aura with brilliant golden light be true to yourself and act decisively today this is another wonderful powerful energy that is coming out from the ascendance masters it's a really wonderful powerful energy that is coming out from the ascendance masters it is the energy um that is coming up for you guys because what is happening is that the sun whenever you call upon the sun is the source of the creator and the energy of the cosmic heart and what you can say is that I am the cosmic heart I am the cosmic heart I am the cosmic heart and what that is saying is that you're connecting with source itself just like the energy of the Sun I am the cosmic heart you're connecting with source just like the energy of the Sun now let's look and see what is coming up for the light workers and you guys have the sixth ray of harmony a lot of people have been having this energy of the sixth ray of harmony this is bringing back harmony in your life and you can see this in the two last week so the first week the third week and the fourth week is going to be very very good what we have here is the pink rose of lady nada so call upon lady nada also to stand in your aura and to bring in this energy of the pink rose of lady nada so it's about harmony and lady nada and i love lady nada because i work with lady nada and she is from the planet of venus and what she does is that she help us to understand what is love and she help us on her journeys so first let's look at the whatever harmonic because that there's definitely situation with relationship that is coming up and it's a past relationship the inauguration for the relationship and to bring harmony back in your life is that now i accept all of my um, own free will the blessings and grace of um the ray of harmony i call upon the grace and assistance of the universe at archangel gabriel to help me find balance wisdom and creativity approaching in all areas of my life i ask for unconditional love assistance to um, grow and and deal with problems in my life i ask for the divine mercies compassion and tenderness to help me grow into all that i am divinely designed designed to be may the heart and beauty within me find alternativeness in expression in the world may i be held from within and grounded in my endeavors and creativity i approach the um portal of intuition may the unconditional love masters and angels um, help me to serve on this divine way of pure white light bringing in the heart chakra healing the heart chakra of all beings for the greatest good through divine mercies will and grace so be it and this is one of the most beautiful decks i can say i love this deck and maybe because i'm a light worker but this deck was created for the light workers and we use it also to activate other people because when i'm activating someone on their spiritual part this is the deck that i use so the other inauguration from Lady Nada is uh, um, I gracefully receive the um, rose um, light, the blessing of Lady Nada in unconditional love. My heart softens and open. The pink light of her well being and blessings fills me with a sweet perfume. I let go. I feel safe and I'm held. I know that I am love always. I am grateful and always for the love, protection, inter intervene of guidance, the hands of the tender grace in my life. In all ways, may I know myself to be worthy of love and love myself truly so that I can only and freely give love to others, to the world may all beams truly love now 
through my own will so be it this is um, one of the most beautiful decks I love this deck and um, I want to say to each and every person go cross watch to see what is happening try and cross watch see what is happening and then you're going to be understanding um, what exactly is happening um, there is going to be um, new starts people are you know protections is here coming up for um, for a lot of you and um, be aware that life is full of uh, surprises okay and we have to be aligned with these energies ladies and gentlemen I want to wish you a wonderful May namaste until next time